यहाँ चाहिँ हाम्रो डल्ले खोर्सानी फल्दै रहेछ एन्ड टमाटर यहाँ कुनै के बैगुन कि के पनि छ भन्दै थियो तर म चाहिँ चिन्दिन आई डोन्ट नो कुन चाहिँ के हो क्या बट दिस इज टमाटर दिस इज मी ए यहाँ को टमाटर चाहिँ रातो पनि भइसके छ बो दामी भएको रहेछ त टमाटर त यो उहिले को किनेको त मजाको छ है पानीमा लाउनु उहिले किनेको कुनै आएर बिर्सि पनि सक्यो यहाँ पनि लागि हुन्छ दामी देख्छ नि त यहाँ अझै यता खबी छ त्यही त दिस इज द वेदर इन कसियाङ ब्रेचुली चाहिँ निकाल्नु पर्छ डोन्ट युज योर ह्यान्ड्स You don't have to be like me. Uh, don't torture yourself. Let it cool and then you can start peeling after it's cold. Uh, but the only thing is uh, if you cut it uh, after it's cold, then it's it's not um, sticky and mushy and I like it that way. So I, I hope you understand what I mean. <laughs> but I can't really explain better than this. So that's why I like to peel it and cut it uh, while it's still hot. So what I'm doing here is I'm actually roasting some uh, peanuts which is uh, badam and in the next clip you'll also see me roasting some uh, kalo teal or black sesame. You also get white sesame but we prefer the white one 
uh, sorry the black one over white no particular reason we've just been using the black one uh, always when we make this attar but I have even used the white ones before uh, so whatever is available you can use that and make sure that you do not burn them because that's going to make your uh, achar bitter so this is the kalo teal i was talking about or the black sesame uh, now regarding the measurements i'm not too sure because i'm very bad with that <laughs> so i always eyeball it so you can just go ahead and uh, see how much alu you've uh, taken and how much teal and uh, peanuts it doesn't matter you can take equal amounts as well I don't have to tell you about this part <laughs> I think it's self explanatory uh, so I'd like to cut it into small pieces rather than medium or large pieces uh, again no particular reason that's how I like so you can do it your way the chopping is completely uh, your way using uh, mustard oil I'm gonna heat that properly otherwise your achar is gonna smell of raw oil you can also use vegetable oil uh, then I'm gonna take some fenugreek seed or methi and throw it in the oil once it's completely heated so as you can see my oil has heated up completely and uh, just turn off the gas and let it cool down for a bit then you can throw in your fenugreek seed or methi and let it sit there for a while, let it cool down uh, and then you can uh, start pouring uh, whatever amount uh, you'd like into the mixing bowl and uh, please be very very careful because there is, it is hot oil so you might burn yourself. Uh, I'm using uh, daru, <laughs> I don't know what it's called, daru and then I'm gonna slowly uh, pour it into the mixing bowl as per uh, the quant quantity that I want. Then you're gonna add uh, 
my favorite ingredient uh, for this uh, achar that is lemon or lime I like to add insane amount but uh, you can uh, add it as per your liking and don't forget your salt and we're almost done here give it a good mix and taste it uh, if you need to add salt or lemon uh, you can do that and uh, that's it that's all uh, that is required for this uh, easy peasy achar and I hope you uh, love it uh, you can have with nice uh, tato tato sukha roti <laughs> or parathas or puris whatever you like that's it for today guys thank you so much for watching i'll see you in my next video till then take care god bless stay safe bye